This intriguing mystery series takes place in a town in Iceland. As a result of a volcanic eruption, under the ice mass, mysterious events begin to occur, in a small town called Vik. A woman appears, whose entire body is covered with ashes. As the woman's identity is revealed, nothing will ever be the same in town. Katla is a series that mystery lovers will like. The series draws us into a magical and different world, accompanied by wonderful landscapes. In this video, I would like to explain the confusing points of the series. Which Grima is still alive? We watched an exciting Russian roulette scene between Ash Grima and the real Grima. As you can see, the pistol can take six bullets. They pulled the trigger, a total of five times. The sixth time, it was Ash Grandma's turn to pull the trigger, and boom! Ash Grima dies. A little later we see his corpse outside. Source of Mysteries It seems that, the source of the mysteries is a meteorite from outside the solar system. It is unknown when it landed on Earth. The meteorite is trapped under the glaciers, and fragments of it are scattered around, when the volcano is active. If Dari's theory is correct, which it seems, this meteorite can understand the emotions of people approaching it, and they copy themselves, or the people with whom they are emotionally intense. In fact, people born from ash are the same as their realities. Their memories, experiences, and appearances are the same as the real ones. But the interesting thing is that, there is an obvious problem of time and space in those born from Ash. For instance, when young Gunhild sees Thor at the hospital, she doesn't realize that he is actually old. She thinks she still works at the hotel, but it has been 20 years since then. 20 years ago, Thor, who got her pregnant, was a young man. In the hospital, this does not seem strange to her at all. If she were a real person, the first question she should have asked should be, Thor. What happened to you? How did you get so old all of a sudden? Here, we can talk about a theory. In the first season, there was a short scene that hinted at this theory I'm going to talk about. Those born from the ashes, when they look at the people they remember, do not see them as old. They see those people the way they remember them just before they die. The scene that points to this theory is exactly this. In the mirror reflection, if you look carefully, you can see the younger version of Asha. What will happen in the second season? Volcanic eruptions continue, as well as ash births. Considering what the old hotel lady said, I think the bad side of new births will outweigh. People began to kill those born from ash, but those who are killed can be reborn from the ashes. In this case, newborns may come in a more aggressive and different format. Because this time they will have the memories of the murderers, and their survival instincts will outweigh. 